Hi friends. Good morning, everybody. Hey, is that okay? Okay. Top and saw calls for 530 seconds file, right? Which is this little guy. Okay. Well, I don't do it. I use 13 or pardon me, 3 sixteenths. I do. I use it. Stay tuned and I'll show you why. It's a hard start. <laughs> runs. Good morning, friends. How's everybody? You doing good? Good. Uh, my boy's just heading off to work. Um, I've talked about this before. I've, 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 I've showed it. But I'm going to show it again. This is a little power saw that calls for the five 30 seconds files, right? This is what it calls for. It calls for this little guy right here. Okay. That's the five 30 seconds. Okay. Well, I don't do that. I go three sixteenths, okay? Like that's a small file. Now let's go in and I'll show you why. Five thirty seconds. See? Okay, it, it'll, it definitely will work. It, it will work, but look. So, boom, boom, I'm down. See, I'm down. Well, look at the, so if I were to, you see how I'm not even, you, you see the space there, don't you? Okay. This is the difference in files. Okay. Three sixteenths. Boom. Watch what happens. Look at three sixteenths. You see what happens? It's right up against the, the top plate. Okay. But you can't just go like this. There, I'm sharp. Well, because you're going to end up with that thing I talk about where you end up with no hook. So, friends. Get down. Get down there. See that? A little burr there. It just takes off. Okay. Um, I've been using this for years. I'll use the five thirty seconds in a pinch. No problem. No problem. So you've got options now too. Okay. You see what I'm saying, right? So let's look at something else. You see that? There's the tooth we just found. You see, you're you're actually you're right underneath. Now here's here's this little guy. Look what actually happens. I mean, look at friends. You can see the space. So I don't use them. I, I don't use the five thirty seconds. You can in a pinch, but it means you have to stay up on here like this. You see what I'm saying? So that's the 530 seconds. Excuse me. Well, here's the here's the 316. Okay, the, they, these call for a 530 seconds. They they do, friends. They call for a 530 seconds. 
I don't do it. Look it. It's beautiful. It rips the gullet right out, gets underneath the top plate. Now remember, this is full chisel chain. So let's look at what the other side looks like. See, even this chain doesn't really have a hook in it right now. See this? Look at it, right? Let's go back to the 530 seconds. Let's have a look. You see what I'm saying? I just don't do it. I don't do it. Now, I've got you guys here, so I'm just showing you. I'm trying to not knock the camera as I do this. It's it's tight quarters in here, but I'm, I'm making it happen. Okay. Did you see what just happened? Okay. Sorry. There we go. Let's get this down a little bit more if we can. Yeah, there we go. This is what I'm talking about. Okay, so you can see. You see? Okay. It's really tight quarters with that phone in, right here, friends. Okay? Sorry. Okay? There we go. Super acceptable. You see what the... See that... The line they give you, I change it a bit. So there we go. There's that little burr right there. Hey, there it is. There it goes. Okay, you can see it there. And I want to show you guys something. We're going to come back in close. I'm going to show you something. I'll just hit this with the... Can you guys actually see that with my hand in the way? Oh yeah, you can. Good. Friends, just because you see me taking a bunch of strokes, it, it my first ones are tough or hard. Watch. This is what I do. Watch. These are these are kind of harder. I'm going down, right? Down. Now that I've done a couple hard ones down, I ease up on my pressure and I let the file do the work. But my first few strokes are down. They just are. 
And you'll hear, hear that on the way back. That's me tinkling the raker. That's what that is. Okay. So this is what we end up with. A very acceptable hook. It's actually what they're calling for. So that's, that's, that's what I do, friends, for that, okay? That's on the top and saw. Here's our top beak. Here's our top piece here. There it is there. See? It's glorious. All right, skis, friends. kind of hard see that down Little bit of a boat action, get me a get me a gullet, and then I straighten out and I just carry on. I need a sharp side plate and I need a sharp a sharp top plate. That's what I need. And a hook. That's what I need. So my first couple strokes are kind of boaty, like this. It just rips me a gullet, that's all it does. Then I straighten out, and I make my tooth sharp. These guys that are doing three strokes a side, oh, I, I don't. There we go, Mr. Gullet. And if you want to see it transform, I'll show it to you again. So you'll see the transformation happen. Let's watch this one transform. Right there. This is what I do. There it was, that was three strokes. You see what I just did? See that? I went right there. I ripped that gullet out. Just don't even worry about the top plate, friends. Don't, don't do it. Don't worry about it, just get the gullet. You gotta get the gullet, see? This is why the 316 file is beautiful, look. I'm still up against the top plate and underneath it at the same time. See, so now, I just, once I got my bottom out, I straightened my file. And I let the file do the work and just do a nice, that's why uh, this three stroke thing's silly. You just put, put, put the pressure you need on the file. See this? I know it's a lot of strokes. I, I, I know that. Okay, that side's done. See that? Rip the gullet right out of her. Boom. Now, see that falls right underneath that top plate. So in order to get it sharp, keep it on a straight line. There we go. Off to the races. This will give you an idea of what I do. You don't have to do the boat. You don't have to do that. Just what I do, because it concentrates on the gullet. You can get it.
by going like this. I'm pushing straight down. Straight down. There. Gullet's gone. You'll notice it pick up your file jaggedly here and there. That's because you've created a hole. Now you just glide that file through there and get that top piece going. And you'll notice if you're going into the side strap, don't worry about it. It is not a worry. These Husky files, I don't recommend these Husky files for these topping saws. We're okay for a 3 8 chain, but this is slow, small stuff. See how they're quite jagged? Pretty coarse. They pull material though, that's for darn sure. Go. Now, see, see how that picks it up? See that when you So I'll show you something. Here's a different 3 16 file right here. Let's use this one. This is an organ file. Okay, this is an organ file right here. Hear the difference right away. I quite like the organ files on these small chains. There we go, that's smooth. Yeah, right there. I, I like the organ for this one. So that's that, friends. We got it. Yeah, that's going to cut nice, this one. We'll see how it cuts. These still all be the same. Might be a little hungry. We'll see. This is a 404 Riker gauge. I think they sell raker gauges for these saws. Three sixteenths files. Catch you on the next video. Be kind to one another.